Wright family won't be watching the big game on TV because they'll actually be there themselves in person. Channel 3's Mark Robbins found out why they're heading to the Super Bowl for the second straight year. Lucas Niang is from New Canaan. He's an offensive lineman now with the Kansas City Chiefs. So that means his mom, Fatu, and dad, Nobby, have gotten to watch him become a Super Bowl champion. So is trying to repeat just as fun for the family? In terms of excitement and in terms of uh, realizing that it's an unbelievable opportunity, it was about the same as it was uh, two years ago. I mean, none of the players are taking that opportunity for granted, and clearly as far as uh, we don't either. It's a life-changing event, and the excitement builds for about two weeks leading up to kickoff. The Niangs have kind of figured out how to approach traveling to the Super Bowl and what's most important and what makes things go as smoothly as possible. Clearly, a lot of people are asking for tickets, <laughs> as you would imagine. So we're trying to accommodate as many people as we can among our friends. 15 tickets, that's the number the Niangs have settled on. And the trip begins for them Thursday night because arriving at the Super Bowl site is one thing, settling in is another. It takes a lot of planning because uh, the Super Bowl uh, is a very big event and there's people everywhere. So you need to be organized in terms of what you want to do because there are a lot of things to do, so you have to be a bit... Las Vegas is going to be different because any Super Bowl is a bit crazy, but uh, you can't expect that Las Vegas is going to be next level crazy. I'm told the Niangs are going to go see you two on Saturday at that new sphere in Las Vegas. That ought to be spectacular. Tomorrow, you're going to see part two of our story, and that's Lucas as a high school star in New Canaan. I'm Mark Robbins, Channel 3, Eyewitness Sports.